Hi everyone, it's April and I'm here for my um, to show my submission for Tamika Scrap the World's pocket loaded pocket swap. Um, I'm gonna go through things kind of fast because there's a lot to show. So if you have any questions, please leave them below and I will answer you. Um, so this is the way the outside packaging is gonna come. I have a ton of these paper bags, so I'm trying to use them all and be creative. So it, it's really simple on the outside, but um, all of them have a different ribbon. And then my information will be on the back. So we had to make a loaded pocket, and there were some requirements that had to go inside the pocket. So that's what I'll go through. So first I'll go with my pocket. And here's what that looks like, that everything will come in. So I just made this box. This is a Stephanie Bernard die. I just love that, it's huge. And a Myrode flower, and I just put some fabric tape. And I did put um, some Velcro in here, or on here, so everything will just fit right inside of the box. So that is going to be the pocket. Back there. Then we had to make two stick pens. And I packaged everything up, so just one second. So here are my stick pens. And it'll come in this little container with an ice cream cone. Oh, and my theme was sweet that I picked. So that you could pick different themes. So mine was sweet. So I have this, I think it's an Echo Park die cupcake and then these are my stick pens and the first one has a little cupcake and some beads and then the second one is a jelly bean I don't know if you can really see that on camera with some more beads so those are my two stick pens so that'll go in there then we had to make a three by three card with matching envelope. So here is my envelope. And I just used some washi tape on the outside from Michaels. And these are pre-made envelopes and cards. And this is my three by three card. And this is a My Creative Time die. It came with a donut and a coffee cup. I just put some pattern paper <clears throat> we had to have a sentiment, and then I just covered the inside with paper. So that is my 3x3 three three card. Then we had to make a flower. If we made two flowers, or if we made smaller flowers, we had to, we could make, we should make two. So here are my two flowers, and these are new dies that I bought from Home Shopping Network from Crafter's Companion. They were 3D dies, so you roll them up. <clears throat> so they're pretty dimensional. So this is the first one. And I just used Unicorn Magic Gold on the tips from Prima. And put a little flat back pearl in the center. And then the second one is kind of this fringe. And I just brushed the tips with that gold paint as well. And put a bead in the center. So those are my two flowers. Then we had to make a tag. And my mistake, it was supposed to be a shaped tag. Mine's in the shape of a tag. Because <sighs> I didn't follow directions. And I didn't notice it until it was too late. So here's my tag. And these are Elizabeth, is it Elizabeth Craft Designs or, or Marianne Craft Designs? One of those two, I can't remember now. These are the macaroon dies, so I just stacked three and then used this word sweet. This is from my creative time as well. And put on some pattern paper and then put my two from on the back. And then you had to have a hanger thing. So that's my tag. If 
that all in there. Then we had to do a teeny tiny embellishment. So this is not it, but I saw this tutorial on YouTube and it was, I thought it was so cute. It's just rib, three different colors of ribbon rolled into a circle and then wrapped in tulle. So it looks like a little wrapped candy. And I just glued it to a clothespin, so that's just an extra little embellishment. And then for my teeny tiny embellishment, um, I made this little cupcake. So I just temporary glue dotted it to this corrugated cardboard. But I used, um, this is a Gina Marie Designs Scallop Square. This is one of those Elizabeth or Marianne Craft Designs um, mini cupcakes, I think it's called, and a glitter heart. And then I just layered it with the star, glittered star back there. So that's my teeny tiny embellishment. And then lastly, we had to have a currently list. So I actually put my currently on this Stephanie Bernard cupcake so that they could use it um, in the future. You know, glue it down on a <clears throat> card base or the front of a gift bag or whatever. So I just cut that out and put my currently on the back. So that is my submission for Tamika. I hope you guys are having a great Monday and I will talk to you soon. Bye.